What's poppin' people? You man, Zeus, <coughs> who likes to drink the juice, is back in town. <laughs> like that cough, don't you? But anyways, bring you guys some Modern Warfare 3 Team Deathmatch. I'm gonna be using my EU. Actually, I'm not gonna be using the EU class, but I'm gonna use, the, gonna use my UMP45 with sleight of hand, quick draw, and sit rep. Using the range proficiency, I have no clue why my... Um, my smart self used the range proficiency since I should have used kick with this. I have no clue why I use range, honestly. Maybe because I thought this would be a long range map or whatever. And blah, 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 blah. But anyways, <laughs> using a UMP45 and I just picked up an M4. The M4 is one of my favorite guns in this game, hands down. That thing's amazing. But uh, before we start, I want to let you guys know why I'm using sleight of hand, quick draw, and uh, sit rep. I believe I'm using sit rep, either that or stalker. Um, those three perks are my favorites. My favorite class so far, like I said, is um, Sleight of Hand, Quick Draw, and Stalker. The reason for this is because Sleight of Hand makes you reload faster and you can switch weapons really fast. Which is awesome. Yeah, I'm using Sit Rep. And the reason why I was using Sit Rep is so uh, if I run into enemy equipment, I'll know where it is and I don't blow myself up. But it never happened, so I was basically using two perks to front. Whatever. <laughs> so like I said, Sleight of Hand, really good. You can switch between your secondary and your primary really fast. And I love that, man. I love doing that. Like I can pick up a weapon off the ground really quick and switch between my primary and my other primary very fast. I love doing that. Um, it's really important because let's say you run out of ammo. Instead of reloading, you just switch to the other one. And you also have quick reload with Slide Hand. So even if you want to reload, you can do that. It doesn't take too long. And uh, the quick draw, I'm using that because I want to be able to throw my equipment faster. Not only that, but it gives you the Slide Hand Pro effect that we used to get in the older Call of Duty games. Which means you can zoom in faster. And uh, that's really, really vital to winning gunfights. If you and another person meet at the same exact time, one person has quick draw, one person doesn't, they both have the same aim, same gun, same proficiency, same everything, the person with quick draw is going to win because his gun pulls up faster, so uh, he gets the first shot on the other person. Quick draw is really important. If you guys are using um, Hardline, uh, Blast Shield, I still recommend you use quick draw. You don't run into too many grenades. I mean, grenades aren't too, too big of a problem in this game since they're not as powerful as they used to be in Modern Warfare 2 and Black Ops. They are still pretty powerful, the frags are, the Semtexes are weak, trust me. But uh, they're pretty powerful, I love this advanced UAV man, it's pretty good. Uh, but yeah, use Quick Draw, check it out, it's an amazing perk, you guys are going to love it. Uh, for those of you who haven't had the game yet, who haven't gotten the game yet, I feel for you guys, I know how it is, it sucks. Uh, just keep watching my vids and other people's videos, you guys will get enough Model for 3 footage from us. And uh, to hold you off until you actually get the game. But anyways, as you guys ever saw with the M4 Silence, you need to try that class out. Uh, if you guys didn't check out my custom class setup tutorial slash guide, it's on my channel. Check it out. Um, I gave you guys a lot of custom class setup guides. I think it was three classes. Really good classes. Really recommend you guys check it out. Um, it's on my channel. Go ahead and check that out. Don't miss it. Uh, it will help you guys a lot. I guarantee it. Moving on. Um, I wanted to say something about the killstreak setup. Oh yeah, I'm using the support killstreaks, which means... Uh, your kill streak does not die. Your kill streak does not end when you die. As you can see, I just got my EMP, my 18 point streak, which means I just got 18 point streak, which means I don't even know. <laughs> I got like I think I got like 16 kills by now, and I got or 18 kills, and then I got like an assist. I have no clue. But I think that when you get two assists, it counts as one kill, or maybe that's the hardline pro effect. I'm not sure yet. Uh, but um, oh, what was it called? Uh, I got my EMP, and that thing is amazing. It lasts. It actually lasts pretty long. And um, the good thing about the EMP in this game is that even if you die, your kill streak doesn't end. So um, that's what's awesome about the support kill streak, I should say. Uh, when you do, when you die, it doesn't end. So it's really awesome. You can be uh, on like one away from your kill streak, and you die, nothing will happen. You can revive, go kill another person, get your kill streak. It's all good. And uh, this kill streak is really good when you're using snipe when you're sniping or using an SMG and you're rushing, because you tend to die a lot when you're rushing, and you tend to die a lot when you're sniping. In this game, I noticed, and probably all the Call of Duty games, because you're going to get killed by people sitting back and chilling in the corners and whatnot. So, use support kill streaks when you're sniping, when you're using SMGs, just so um, you can get those kill streaks even if you die. If you're using an assault class and you want to sit back or flank, then I advise you to use the assault kill streaks. My favorite assault kill streak so far is the Predator, Overwatch, or Stray Front, and the Prevlo. Now, the reason for that is when you get your Predator, it you get let's say one or two kills, and then you're few away from your uh, pave from your Overwatch helicopter. Once you call in your Overwatch helicopter, it will protect you, it will follow you around, and make sure your enemies don't kill you. At least that's what I think it does. It just follows you around and kills any enemies near you. So you check that out. And then uh, a few more kills with that and your gun. A 12 kill streak, you get your pave low, and the pave low goes to work in this game. It's amazing in this game. You guys really need to try out the pave low. It's an amazing kill streak. I don't recommend using the Osprey gunner. 
because it's gonna I mean I saw people use it uh, it's man it's all right uh, but uh, 18 kill streak is difficult guys 18 kill streak not as easy as getting a pay blow uh, you're gonna get the pay blow much more consistently and um, the you see the weapon I picked up right now the Scarface as my boy JM Blaze likes to call it what up JM this gun is a beast too you guys really need to try this out especially with the red dot of the silencer those are two really good attachments for it you guys need to try them out and um, like I said in my uh, first Mono for 3 video I'm gonna be giving you guys a lot of tips tutorials tricks all kinds of things for Mono for 3 to help you guys out and do better because I know a lot of people are struggling with Call of Duty and Mono for 3 and I uh, happen to be pretty good at the game not the best never claimed to be uh, but I'm uh, maybe I have claimed to be just to mess with you guys and troll on Twitter but um, <laughs> If you guys haven't followed me on Twitter, follow me. It's Z-U-E-S, the number two drink juice. That's my Twitter. Follow me on there. I troll a lot and have a lot of fun on there, so follow me on there. But anyways, I'm not the best, but I know uh, a couple trips, uh, a couple tricks and tips here and there. Tricks and tips. Tips and tricks. And uh, one of them is use the noob tubes. <laughs> you know, I'm just kidding, guys. Do not use the, YouTube, the noob tubes. I just saw this guy and I wanted to get the final kill cam with it and because I, I was playing with some people and I wanted to troll them. <laughs> but anyways, I hope you guys enjoy. Leave a rating, leave a comment, and subscribe if you haven't subscribed already. Hope you guys enjoy. I'm out of here. Peace out. Check out the videos on my channel. I'm out of here. See ya.